From the News Channel 5 Network, I'm Rory Johnston. You may have seen that Amber Alert earlier tonight for two children missing out of Clarksville. We have some good news to pass along. Liesia and Travion Thompson have both been found with their mother in Virginia. They're now safe. Jennifer Lewis is their non-custodial mother. Police tell us they do have her in custody. 20 people awaiting trial in Nashville, including an accused killer, have had their ankle bracelet monitoring turned off. The third party company that monitors offenders are not getting paid, so they stopped the monitoring. The president of that company tells us the offenders had been ordered to, uh, by the court to pay the fee linked to the device. Each of them owed more than $600. Our Eric Hilt spent the day getting the details of this situation. You can find more on the story on our website. A reminder that if you plan to go to Murfreesboro to see the MTSU versus TSU game this weekend, you need to know about a change in stadium policy. MTSU is starting a clear bag policy this season, which means any non-clear bags bigger than four by six inches will not be allowed inside the stadium. Tomorrow's game is set to kick off at six at Floyd Stadium in Murfreesboro. Also happening this weekend, the Tennessee State Fair at the Fairgrounds Nashville. Some of the big events planned are the 4-H Live Butterfly Exhibit, Music City Monster Mayhem, and dozens of free competitions. The fair is already up and running. It will be open through next weekend. Now here's Bree with your weekend forecast. Looking like a great one to get out for the fair. 69 overnight tonight as a weak cold front works its way across the area. You'll feel the effects of it Saturday afternoon, which is pretty good timing. It'll keep us in the mid 80s for your top temperature. That means most of the day will be in the 70s and low 80s. That's some of the best weather we've had. Now the heat does surge back by Sunday back to 90 and then mid 90s with humidity creeping back in by the middle of next week.